Hey everybody, RBCP here. I just finished editing this uh, video and the audio file, the audio podcast at the exact same time. And uh, just to let you know, like the audio sucks in the YouTube version. I don't know why. So if you're looking for a good listening experience, you shouldn't listen on this video. Instead, you should go to phonelosers.org and listen through the podcast version or listen on Stitcher or tune in. Uh, but for some reason, the audio is really bad on here. Also, the audio is longer. The podcast version is 40 minutes less than this video. And the stuff I've edited out is mostly just silence, you know, like ringing and voicemails picking up and just boring stuff. So if you want a better listening experience, go to phonelosers.org and listen to the podcast. But if you want to watch the video version that has inferior audio, it sounds like I'm on speakerphone the whole time or something. You, you'll notice the difference between how I sound right now and how I sound on the show. It's, it's a pretty big difference if you care about that sort of thing. But if you want to see the chat room, I think it's cool that the chat room's in there. I wish I could edit separate versions of both of these, but I can't. I just don't have time. This took me a full three hours to edit the podcast and this video together. So that sucks. I can't do that again. Fuck that shit. Anyway, enjoy this show. And if the audio gets on your nerves, turn it off and go listen to the podcast version. And one other thing, let me know what you think about this as, you know, for the videos, instead of doing just the spinning reel to reel thing, having the chat room on there, uh, it's going to mean inferior audio, like you're going to hear in this video, but the chat room's there and that's kind of cool, I think. So in the comments, just tell me what you think of this. Should I keep doing this or should I do how it's been before where you get a nice, good quality edited version? Let me know. Bye. Broadcasting from the PLA Situation Room in Roy, New Mexico, you're listening to The Snowplow Show. Now it's time. On Prank Call Nation. Cactus, 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 Cactus. This could be a fuck job to edit. Cactus, 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 cactus. At twelve o'clock midnight, fuck you. Okay, hey, hey everyone, it's RBCP. You're listening to the Art of Phone Marking with RBCP and the Phone Larkers. Yeah, so um, Gad couldn't make it. I think he's dropping out of prank calls forever. I don't know what's going on with him, but I think he's done. So Friday nights are opening up now, so I guess I'm going to be doing them. And I might just steal his show name if I feel like it. Snowplow show is stupid anyway. So no g -ad tonight. Sorry, everyone. I think my Mixler uh, plan worked. I went on to the old Mixler and told everyone to switch over. And there are now 49 people listening on the new Mixler. And the new Mixler is Mixler.com slash live. No, no, I keep saying that. Mixler.com slash prank call nation. I'm going to have to write that down because I keep forgetting it. Prank call nation is Carlito's brand new network of prank callers. And it's, nothing's going to change, really. It's just the name. Uh, Carlito was tired of being associated with people like us, people like me. Because, you know, I'm saying I'm broadcasting on Madhouse, but Madhouse is the name of his show, and it's just confusing for everyone. So so he wants something else that, that, won't, that won't lead the feds back to him next time. So, Prank Call Nation. PrankCallNation.com. There's a Facebook and a Twitter... Oh, and that reminds me, I'm killing the old Twitters and the old Facebook, the live prank call network thingy. Killing all that, because it'll be too confusing with two of them, so screw all that. And also Carlito said that if I, if I didn't kill the old ones, he would kick me off of the network, and I don't want that. So Carlito's making me kill my old Facebook and the old Twitter, announcement Twitter. So go, get rid of those and go to twitter.com slash... Prank Call Nation, Facebook.com slash prank, prank Call Nation. Because Carlito's a jerk and he doesn't want 
He doesn't want the competition. Is the problem. So remember last time I did an evening show? And um and I, I just called gym, uh, you know, fitness gym people for three hours and it was just mostly phone ringing. It just, you know, people's phones would ring and nobody would ever answer. And, um, yeah, and I, I think the three-hour show ended up being one hour because there was so much just ringing and other other crap. Well, I'm going to do that again this week. <laughs> so, but, but first I'm going to call this number Dashy gave me. I guess they've been bothering this guy. He posted on Twitter that his Comcast was broken. Hopefully everyone can hear this. Yeah, yeah, they can hear it. Sorry, no Lux on this show. I hate Lux. Hello, you reach Robert at 757. Let me try again. So that was just a small sample of what you're going to hear for the rest of the next three hours. Phones, phones just ringing and voicemails picking up. Thanks for nothing, Dashy and Polkja. I think I heard one of the calls to this guy, and it's pretty funny. He gets angry. He's complain. He's a Twitter complainer. He's complaining. Hello, about, you reached Robert. About his cable being broken or something. So let me write on that. No answer. Yeah, I'll try him later. If I remember. So besides broadcasting on Mixler.com slash Prank Call Nation tonight, I'm also broadcasting on YouTube. I'm on... Oh, let me make sure I have that turned on, by the way. Yeah, yeah. Sound's on. Yes, I'm on YouTube. Uh, I guess to go there, you just go to YouTube slash Phone Losers of America, and there'll probably be a link to it. But there's a live YouTube link, and it's showing the chat room and nothing else that's useful. So if you want to listen through YouTube, there's a huge delay, and it's stupid to listen through YouTube. Uh, the best way to listen, if you don't like delays, is Mixler, because Mixler is really fast. I think there's more of a delay from YouTube than there is on the, the Shoutcasts. But I, I have to remember to mute... To mute YouTube whenever I play music, or else they'll kick me off like they did last time. Okay, so yeah, I guess I'll just start calling numbers. I, I think I've done my contractual obligation to Carlito, and I've plugged prankcallnation.com as much as I can. So please don't fire me, Carlito. Um, prepare for the ringing. Ringing phones and voicemails. Here we go. Sorry, Enigma. See? Ringing phones. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message. <sighs> okay. Let's try and call Darren. I'm actually calling fitness people that I sent to Carlito over a week ago, and he never called him because he's a big stupid... Said he lost him or something. So I had to go dig him up so I could call them myself. It wouldn't go to waste.
Your call has been forwarded to an automated... Hey, Badfish, are you able to listen? Because, you know, I'm broadcasting on Shoutcast. Badfish is the only person in the universe that does not know how to listen through Mixler. He thinks he needs to go buy a $500 computer to listen on Mixler because it won't work for him. They don't know how to work computers. God. Please leave your message for 81. Okay. See, I told you. Ringing phones all night. Badfish didn't answer, so I'm assuming he doesn't know that that the thing's on. The thing. The shoutcast. So what should I say to gym people? I never know. Nunu had a funny idea about them going too fast because it's a school zone. That'd be funny. The Sprint voicemail box of nine... Ugh. I was kidding. I didn't really think it was just going to be no answers all night. Is this Alexandra? Hello? Hello, is this Alexandra? Uh, no. Oh, is she around? Yeah, who's this? This is Greg. I'm calling from the gym. Oh, hang on. Oh, hello? Hello, is this Alexandra? Yeah. Hey, it's Greg from the gym. Hi. Hi. There, there was a small problem. You were in here um, the last time you were in here. You, you went into the wrong restroom. Use the men's restroom? No, I didn't know that's not me. Oh, no, it's definitely you because we saw you check in and then we saw on the, the security cameras that you went into the men's room. At 24 Hour Fitness? Yes. I wouldn't, why would I go into a men's bathroom? I don't know. Maybe you were mistaken or something. Like you, you thought it was the women's room, but you definitely went to the men's room. Okay. But the, the real problem is that you, you took a, a big, a big, a big poop. In the urinal. You know what a urinal is, right? Like, is this a it's, joke? No, ma'am. No, our the the front. I desk. don't know who checked in under my name, and I don't. Who, what's your name? Uh, my name is Greg, and, and Nicole's the one that checked you in, and she went in. She saw that you came out of the men's room, so she went in there and she saw that you took took a big dump in the urinal. And the the urinal. Oh. So Nicole from Canada, she wanted me to say that to people. And I think I'm going to do that several more times and see what happens. I thought I was going to do that to a male, but it's a female. Hello? Hey, we got disconnected somehow. Okay, who is this again? Uh, my name is Greg, calling from the gym. Okay. And is this Alexandra again? No, this is her mom. I have a gym membership with her. Oh, okay. Well, she's denying what happened. But um, she she came she went into the men's room accidentally. Do you have this on video? Yeah, yeah. It's, we have security cameras throughout the entire building. No, you and, do not. You don't have it on camera. No, you don't. Not in the bathroom. And if you did, if you did, you'd have a police report. Do you have a police report? It's not a pol it's not a, an illegal thing. I'm just saying it's like. So why are you calling? She needs to be more careful because she went into the bathroom and she took. She took a big shit in the urinal. Like I guess she doesn't, Oh god, she doesn't, that's that's ridiculous. She doesn't know what a urinal is apparently. She thought she was in the women's room. 
No, she didn't. And I mean, it's happened before, but we've never had anyone take a big shit in the urinal. No, this is this. No, she no, she didn't. She did. She did. She's the only one that was in there. And Nicole went in What's there. What's your last name, Greg? What's your last name? Carson. What? Carson. Okay, I'm going to call you back at the gym's number, and I'm going to talk to you from that number, okay? That's fine. But, I mean, really, we just need Alexandra to not take shits in the urinal, or just to use the women's room, you know? So that's gross. We have to clean that up. She's gone. <laughs> she thought it was a bidet. So, wow, that was the third person third person I called, or maybe fourth, and they answered. Sinks, are you watching on the YouTubes? You, you should look on the YouTubes. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Dirt. <laughs> Hold on a second, let me find something here. Okay. MacMan says the delay, I assume he's talking about YouTube because it's a really long delay. He said is it, it is 68 seconds long, which is crazy. That's like not even a live show. You're listening to an old show at that point. Uh, but if you're on YouTube, you could see the picture that Sinks drew me. She's in the chat room. It's some sort of cactus monster thing. Cactus dragon. It's pretty amazing. I'm going to try the thing that Dashi gave me again. One more time. So I'm sure I'm going to forget it later. Hello, you reach Robert at 757 ah, That was two rings. Ah, crap. What the fuck? Why is that ha Oh, no. No. Oh, I know why that happened. Okay, never mind. I thought that was a bad thing there for a second. Hello, you reach Robert at seven. All right. Okay. Okay. Okay, more fitness people. Uh, big Danny wants me to say their boobs are too big on the next person I call. And there was, that was actually in the news recently. Uh, it wasn't... What was it? I think it was Planet Fitness. And, um... No, no, no. She didn't have boobs that were too big. She was too fit. And she was making the other people uncomfortable with her amazing body. So they, they kicked her out or something. I don't know what happened. I didn't even read the article. I just skimmed it. It was boring. But... Hey, you missed. Uh, leave a message and I will call you back later. Thanks. Try her again. Kaliki wants to know if I ever gave out the award for the best camel toe. And I sort of did, but I did it by voicemail. I need to do that live. Uh, leave a message. Stupid, stupid Brittany. 
Oops. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice message. Ah, stupid Bill Man. Complaining that I'm not on Mixler. Uh, Jillian wants to know if I get the request to pranks on Madhouse's site. No, I don't. That's not my site. That's Carlito's site. So, uh, there is a request a prank form. I've been told it's not working. I kind of made it myself, so it's garbage, but... It's on phonelosers.org slash snowplowshow. You can request pranks there, and there's no guarantee I'll actually do them, but I might if it works, if, if it even goes through. I, I get them occasionally, so I'm pretty sure it works. So now I'm going to call Jennifer. Uh, tonight, Mixler is winning the contest. There are 69 listeners on Mixler, 52 on YouTube, I'm sure some of those are doubles, and only uh, uh, 52 on Shoutcast. So even though Badfish says the Mixler is dumb, it's winning. have reached the voice mailbox of nine Awesome, there are 19 new people following me on Mixler now. I mean, following Prank Call Nation on Mixler. So, yay! I guess that worked, my, my trick from earlier. We're sorry, you have reached a number that has been disconnected or is no longer in service. If you Okay, so those are all the numbers that I gave to Carlito. I've called them all now, and only one really picked up. Damn it. So uh, I guess I'm glad Carlito didn't call those because they would have sucked. He would have just made fun of me on a show, and I don't want that. But I do have new fitness numbers, like a big old list. I don't know how long I'm going to go on tonight. Maybe just two hours. Maybe three. But I only have another 25 numbers here. So Something I've had in the show notes for a while is that I really should call Randy Dandy back. And half of you don't remember Randy Dandy. Oh, wait, I should play Randy Dandy. Hold on. Let me, let me go to Phone Losers YouTube. Phone Losers of America. Let's play a Randy Dandy prank, and then I will attempt to call him back. Because I looked up his number the other day, and it, it was it was there. It existed. Ah, but I don't see the prank. I thought I put it on the phone losers 
thing. Is it... Is it... No, it's not that one. Huh. Damn it! Okay, well, if you know who Randy Dandy is, you'll, you'll find this humorous. He's on the YouTubes somewhere. I just don't know exactly where to find it. And he's probably... It's probably a disconnected number anyway. It's probably pointless to even talk about this, but... Let's call it. He's the one that said he'd put the pistol to me. I'll put the pistol to you. I'll put the pistol to you. Hello? Hi, is Randy there? What? I just asked for Randy and she hangs up. God. They can't know my voice. That was like five years ago. Hi. Don't hang up on me, goddammit. I just need to talk to Randy. Is this Ann? Ann? I noticed you like to listen to the TV really loud. Put Randy on the phone, god damn it. Human feces. I don't think she's listening. She just took it off the hook and left it. So now I can't even call back and get into their answering machine like last time. I haven't been on for two hours, Jill. I've only been on for 30 minutes. I just uh, I started the streams a little bit earlier and played old shows. Because people love when I do that. That's not confusing at all. Stupid Jill. Okay, yeah, Randy's busy. So I'll save that in my show notes, and I will call him again some other time. Maybe in the mornings, so I can wake them up. Catch them more off guard. Woo! Live show, lots of ringing phones. The number or code you have dialed is incorrect. Please check. No, uh, come on. The number. All right, let's call Larry then. Hello? Hello? Hey, Larry. Yes. Hey, it's 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 Brad from the gym. Yes. And you were in here earlier and you used the bathroom? I did? Yeah. Um, you know the urinals are not for pooping, right? I didn't do that. Oh, no, it, it definitely was you. You're, you were the only one in there since I cleaned them up earlier. I don't know what you're talking about, but I didn't do that. You don't know what I'm I talking went about. In, I have prostate cancer. I had to go in the bathroom to change my uh, pad. Uh huh. Well, I, I didn't do that. But, but you can't poop in the urinal. Like, the urinals aren't for pooping. I did not but, poop in the urinal. Who said that I did that? No, well, no, I, I saw that you went in there, and you were the only one in there, and, and then there was poop in you the urinal. You saw me go into the restroom with the stall and I changed my prostate uh, pad. I did not go into your and poop in your... That's ludicrous. You know, I'm, I'm not supposed to say this really, but we have cameras in the bathroom, so we saw you poop in the urinal. Tell you what, I'm going to be in there tomorrow and I'm going to be in there with a lawyer and let's go ahead and review that, that thing because that's bullshit. Okay. What's your name again, please? You're going to find a lawyer on Saturday? That's that's a little weird. <laughs> you really don't know who I am, but you're going to find out. Oh, you're, the so rain is going to start. You're like a really important person. 
You've got a camera that saw me at what time do that today? Uh, earlier today. I don't know the time. I'll have to go back. It's in the office. I have to go look at the timestamps. But it was definitely you. You pooped, and you're the only one in the bathroom. Because I, I clean it up after each person goes in there. To, I'm going to you know, be down there. I'm going to be down there here in the little... Are you still there? Yeah, I'm here right now. I want to see your film. I want to see your film. Okay, it's not a film. Uh, you know, this is the 21st century. But we, we do have... Um, we, we're, we're very modern. We have VCRs. And, then and, it's on a VCR digital recorder, is that correct? Yeah, it's magnetic tape. It's not a film. And what's your name, please? Uh, my name is uh, Kevin. And you saw me do this at what time? Uh, who knows? I mean, it was earlier, when you were in here earlier, like a few hours ago. It's it's all written down. It's, it's time-stamped. We have like a video... It's time-stamped, but I have no idea what you're talking about, what you think happened. I did not do that. Are you going to bring your lawyer tonight? I mean, like, because you're so important, you can get a lawyer on Friday it's, night, it's too? Your, give me your phone number, young man. All right, it's 636-282-4221. Make sure you write hey, with pencil. Your you got a supervisor on duty with you? Oh, no, he's not here right now. He just works in the daytime. I'm in charge What at time did this happen, Kevin? Oh, don't talk to me in that tone of voice. I'll, I'll get my lawyer, lawyer over here, and, and he'll sue you for talking down to me. Because you don't know who I am. You don't know who you're messing with. I'm a really important... Okay, he's gone. I can't believe he talked to me like that. Hi, this is Larry and Cindy. Okay. I'm not going to bother him again. Poor guy has cancer. But man, he went straight to the lawyers, didn't he? And I don't want to know about his cancer and changing his pad and stuff. That's that's depressing. Ah, horse has a point. Treating him different because he has cancer would be worse. That that's like when I don't prank old people because they're old. That's that's not nice. Or, or I'm not allowed to be mean to a black person because he's black. That would be racist. Nope, I have to be equal with everyone. It needs to be like the prank caller's code. We need to ignore religion, race, um, disabilities. We need to make fun of retarded people. If we don't make fun of retarded people, we're no better than them, than those dumb retards. Badfish says, if we don't lift, if we don't laugh at cancer victims, who will? God damn it. Hi, sorry, Mr. Call. Please leave a message. Thanks. And Evil Ideas has a point. I'm old enough to prank old people. I'm an old person, so why shouldn't I prank old people? Hey, Corey. Who's calling, please? I'm calling for Corey. May I ask who's calling? Uh, my name is Roy. I'm calling from the gym. From the gym? Yep. Okay, one moment. I, on the caller ID, it was a weird number. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> one moment. Okay. Who's Corey? 
Hey, Corey. It's Roy from the gym. You were in here earlier. Okay. And use the bathroom. And um, um, did I, I use the bathroom? Is that what you said? Well, no. We saw the, on the cameras that you used the bathroom, and like after you left, uh, we noticed that you had uh, you had pooped in the urinal. What? And um, I mean, I don't know if you understand what a urinal is, but you can't do that because we have to clean that up. That's hilarious. I definitely didn't do that. Oh, maybe you think it's hilarious because you don't have to pick it up, but we we have to clean it up here. No, it's hilarious because I didn't do it. I don't know why. Why would it be hilarious in, in any... Why are you calling me, like, saying that I did this? Because you did. Because I mean, we know it was you. You're the only one in the bathroom. We saw you come out of the bathroom, and then we went in there to I clean it up. I didn't use the bathroom. I weighed myself no. on the scale. In the bathroom. And went out. No, I weighed myself on the scale and went out. No, and then you went in the bathroom after the scale. We have the, we have it on Negative. the video. On the, you on have the me on, I'd like to see this video. Oh, why don't you come over right now? We'll, we'll see. We, we have cameras in the bathroom. And, and it was definitely you pooping in the in the urinal. No, definitely wasn't. Um, next time I come up there, I'll check it out. I mean, I'm not going to come up there tonight. Why but, not? Because uh, you know, because you know we're right. Negative. Who is this? Roy. Uh, my name is Roy, from the gym. You you work there? Of course. Okay. Can I talk to your manager? Oh, no. He's not here at nighttime. It's just me. Oh, what convenience. Um, but really, I mean, you're acting like I'm the jerk here, and you're the one that pooped in the urinal. That is a negative. Dude, I would not I would not do that. First of all, I didn't even use the bathroom. We know that you did it, because we saw you come out of the bathroom, and then we looked on the security tapes, and that that confirms it. It was you. Like, you can't just go around pooping in the urinal. It's... I understand that. Because you know, urinals don't flush like that. We have, to, we have to clean it up. I've never pooped in a urinal in my life. Yeah. You're, you're kind of an asshole. I mean, first of all, no, you do you're that. You're being an asshole because I don't deny know how it. you have me on camera. That's that's the funny thing. I went in the bathroom to weigh myself on the scale, went off the scale, and proceeded to the exit. Yeah, and this is, is the reason we have cameras in the bathroom. What? This is the reason we have cameras in the bathroom, because we, we know you're going to lie about this kind of stuff when people vandalize the bathroom like this. I'm glad you do because of that, and I would like to see this footage. Oh, good. Come over here, and you can see it. All right. I'll probably be Maybe I'll just Tuesday. cancel your Tuesday account. next time I'll work out. I'm just going to cancel your account and then ban you from the property. So how about you just don't come in ever again? You should, or you will? I will, right now. How can you do that? Here, I'm, I'm typing, typing in the, okay, and there, canceled. No more account with us. That looked like a fake noise, sounded like a fake noise. Yeah, um, it's a fake noise. You can't noise. cancel my account without your manager's approval, I'm sure. Oh, no, I can do anything I want. I'm the assistant manager here. All right, well. So you just see what happens the next time you try and check in. They're going to have you escorted off the premises. Do you want me to come up right now and look at this footage? No, no, you don't need to come in ever again. You're just going to deny it. Like, we don't care. Just stay yeah, away from I our don't building. Deny it because it never happened. If you, if you come in here, we're going to call the police on you. Make you, make them take you Are away. Are you serious? Yeah, because you, you vandalized our property. Okay, um, so you're Roy. What's your last name? Carson. Okay. Really okay, you have fun reporting me for for being upset that you pooped in the urinal. Hey, because I'm sure I I'm sure they're going to take someone, hey, listen, they're going to take my side. Someone for did it. that too, but it wasn't me. Oh, it was definitely you. I mean, I know what you look like, and we saw you in, on the security tape, and you're the only one in the bathroom. No, because I'd never used the bathroom. Yeah, you went in the bathroom. You already said you went in the bathroom. I never used the bathroom. I used the scale. And then, you, and then you pooped in the, the urinal. That's part of the sink area. I never actually walked into the place with you the You can urinal. deny it all you want, but it's on tape. I know. It's on that's the security why I tape. I would like to see this tape. You, you, that's, that's pretty sick. Is that like a perverted thing? You want to watch yourself poop in the urinal? What color hat was this guy wearing? You mean you. Just, just say it. Say what color hat was I wearing. No, what color hat was this guy wearing? 
the, the tapes are, the security system's in black and white. But whatever, just stay away from here, okay? Don't come back. I have canceled your account with my fake noises that you call them, and you're not welcome here anymore, or, or at any other of our locations. Okay, what's your um, store? Blah, store blah, manager? blah, blah. I'm hanging up. No, what's the what's No, the no, manager? really, really, I'm hanging up. That's what's going to happen next. I'm hanging up. Asshole. Check it. He got the last word in there. Uh, I think he won that prank. He's the winner. So those last two pranks uh, were brought to you by Nicole from 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 up there, that one country, Canada. Nicole in Canada, thanks for the urinal pooping prank thing. Prank Call Media wants to know when the new CD is coming out. It's coming out any day now. If you were on the Patreon page, you'd have a link to it already. It's I uploaded it to there just to give those people a, a false sense of getting something special. Uh, but I'm waiting for the physical CDs to arrive. And as soon as those arrive, I'm going to make a post about it and upload the free album for people to download. And I'm going to put it on Bandcamp. I think the CDs will be here. I thought they'd be here this week, but they didn't arrive. So hopefully early next week. Yes, Robitussum, I'm live right now. Woohoo! <sighs> Someone in the chat room's name is Urinal Poop 2014. That's the best thing ever. Fifteen more minutes, and then we need to take a break. It's the hourly break. It's my hourly break guarantee on the shows I do. So I have cancer. I have to go in and change my pad in the bathroom. So you never guess what this guy's name is. It's Mike Tucker. Carlito, where does Tucker Mike live? Maybe I accidentally got his phone number. That'd be hilarious if I ended up pranking him. Hello? Hi, is Tucker Mike there? Just a minute. Okay. See? See? Oh. Hi, Tucker Mike. Yeah. Hey, it's Roy from the gym. You were in here earlier today? Yeah. And um there's a small problem. You were you were um you were on the machine, right? Where you were running? No, I went on the machine. Who is this? I already told you, my name's Roy from the gym. How'd you get this number? I work at the gym. It's in the computer. You gave it to us. Why are you Why are you getting all pissed off at me? What do you want? I, I need to talk to you about what you did when you were in here. It's It's kind of awkward thing to talk about, but you know you can't start, start talking. You can't do that kind of thing in here. That's disgusting. There's other There's kids in here. There's other people the in here. What the fuck are you talking about? I'm talking about what you did when you were in here. It's gross. Don't, hey, don't be calling this fucking phone no more. If you hang up, I'm calling right back. Go ahead. See what happens. Watch me call right back. He hung up. So I take that as permission to call him right back. Wow, Tucker Mike's an angry guy. 
Tucker Mike? Tucker Mike? Who the fuck are you? I, I already told you. It's Roy from the gym. Bullshit. Why are you saying bullshit? Roy, what's your last name, Roy? It's your bell. Who's your boss? Why, why are you getting mad at me? You're the one that's being disgusting on our what on our premises. What the fuck are you calling my house at fucking 10 o'clock? Why are you being... I wasn't even on the fucking treadmill. I didn't say you were on the treadmill. But you're being disgusting when you're here. You, you don't... I mean, you need to act civilized. What are you talking about, you dude? Know, you know what I'm talking about. That was disgusting. And, and there were kids right in the next room and other people around... And come on, think of other people. Think of someone besides yourself. Hey, I'm going to tell you something, Roy Jorabello. I'll have your fucking job there, bud. Oh, you're not qualified to work here. H how about I just cancel your account? Hey, that'd be fucking fine. Okay, here goes. I'm typing in the sequence of characters that I have to cancel your account. Don't be with. fucking calling me back no more. Canceled. Cancel. Don't come back. Keep your perverted fetishes somewhere else. Wow. I thought Tucker Mike was like a laid-back guy that, that made comics and smoked weed. I think I just got to know, to know the real Tucker Mike. Yeah, he mispronounced my name. He called me like Roy Jorobelli or something. Jorbello. Jorobello. That's my new name. So Horse sent me a link to... Um, ah, hold on. Let me get it again. To the Randy Dandy call. And I want to play it. Like, he claims this is the right link. Let's see what it is. Yeah, Randy will put the pistol to you. Hello? Oh, hi. Could I talk to your wife, please? Who? To your wife, please. Eh, what the hell you want? To the female of the house. Uh, she, she, this is the front desk. She, nigga, she asked for a, nigga, a wake shut up. shut the fuck up, she man. Asked, what she, the hell you keep calling my house for, dude? She asked for a wake up call at 12 o'clock. I'm sorry I'm late. Man, you know why I stay here, dude? You know what? You, you know why I stay here? Because you can come over here, cuz. No, I, I can't. You can come over here, cuz. You know why I stay here? I can't leave the front desk right now. But. It, can you put her you on? Can't the leave the front desk right now. Yeah, it's. Could you put her on the phone? I need to make sure she's awake. Well, how about I come where you at? Since you can't leave the front desk, can I come where you is? All right, you can come down to the front desk if you'd like. Where you at? Where you at? At the front desk. Where you at? Where you at? Don't worry about where, where you at. I'm. Don't worry about where I'm. Where, where you at? Where you at? You you're playing with the wrong one, partner. <laughs> partner. Partner. <laughs> I'm a partner. I put the I'm pistol a, to you. I'm a partner. <laughs> partner. I put the pistol to you. You repeat yourself. Partner. <laughs> I'll put the pistol to you. I see you got your little homegirl in the background. Y'all no, drinking sweet and taking the game. Background. I'm in the foreground. Hey, listen. Oh, you in the foreground. You in the foreground. Listen. So y'all want a phone bang. Listen, I want to tell want you phone something. Bang. You want to call me and you want a phone bang? Look, I know. Nigga, I know. nigga, nigga, <laughs> nigga come through. I know come who through. called you earlier. I want to give you all his personal information. His name's Carlito, and I have his home phone number right now. He gave it to me last week. Do you, do you want it? You was a faggot, cuz. No, I'm not. You a faggot, cuz. You a motherfucking faggot, cuz. You a motherfucking faggot. I don't want no goddamn Carlos number, nigga. No, I got all his blood. personal info. You can go kick his ass. Nah, he, man, look here, dude. He made that lady here, really dude. pissed off look earlier. Look here, dude. Look here, dude. Look here, dude. <laughs> what? Dude. What was dude. that? I'm a real what? dude. Dude. What? Dude. I'm sorry, what? Don't call my house no more, cuz. I'm going to call you after dude. you hang up. Dude, don't call my house no more. You think this shit's sweet? I wish I wish I could find out where the hell you was calling from, partner. I wish I could find out where the hell you was calling from, partner. Because you wouldn't think it's sweet. You wouldn't think it's sweet when I came through there, start letting off motherfucking shots at your motherfucking house. You wouldn't think it was sweet you, then, You don't dog. even know how you to fire a gun. Then, you, would don't, you? you don't know how would. a gun works. And I bet, I bet your puss ass won't come around here. I bet your puss ass won't come around here. You, you don't, I bet your puss ass won't come around here. You don't know how to huh. use a gun. You don't know how to fire what? a gun. You say what, nigga? You don't know how to use a gun. You've, you've never nigga, touched a gun. Say it again. I don't call zero. Nigga. Say it again. You in Columbia? 
don't 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 call Vera, okay? I got it numb. I'm gonna report. You in Columbia? Yeah, I'm at the front desk. We can give you our phone number. No, just let him hang up. No, put her up, put her on the phone, okay? Listen to your woman. Boy, Boy you calling me behind these phones? Hiding behind these phones? Aren't you sad? You, you can't shoot me. Phones, boy. <laughs> you hiding behind these phones? You ain't no G, cuz. Cuz, you ain't no man, dog. Got you ain't no real man, dog. Say you me. ain't no real dog. You ain't no soldier out here, dog. I'm dog, not a real I dog. Serve you, dog. Dog, 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 I will serve you, dog. I can't dog, understand I what you're you. saying. Can you repeat it five more times? I have no idea what you're saying. I think you have that. <laughs> Finally. Did you hang up, dog? Did you hang up, dog? Did you hang up, dog? <laughs> okay. That's it. That's Randy Dan Randy Dandy. Let me try him one more time, because uh, the, the lady that you heard in that call in the background, or, in, yeah, the background, uh, she she she's probably the one I talked to earlier that hung up on me. Pretty sure that guy's dead by now. Randy's dead from a drive-by or some other gang-related activity. Hello? Hey, let me talk to Randy. Hello. Hurry up. Hey. Yeah. Can you hear me? Yeah, I'm here. Where is he? I don't know. Do you have a cell number or something? You gotta move on or something. What? You got a new phone. I don't know his number. Oh, come on. Yeah, you do. Don't lie. Don't be a big liar. Oh. <sighs> Good old Randy Dandy. That sucks. Maybe we'll work on getting his cell phone number someday, or whatever number he has. Um, someone wants to know if I got their prank request. I'm not going to be sitting here checking my email during the show. You have to do your prank requests before the show starts. And I'm bad about doing prank requests anyway. I'll probably never do it. No, I will. I'll try. But, you know, probably not tonight. I'm sure it's in my email, though. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention like uh, the, like a week after I called Randy, or a few days after, uh, I called back and got their machine, and I I managed to get into the machine and change the message, say something crazy. Let's try her one more time. Maybe I'll get the machine. Hello. Hello? Hey, what you doing? Who is this? It's Roy. I just want to talk to Randy. Isn't there like yeah, here. Isn't there somebody you know that knows Randy? Like you could call them and get get his number from them. Hello. Oh, they know Randy. She's asking. Oh my God. I said I don't know his number. Hello. Hi. I don't know his number. Oh, come on. You got to know somebody that knows his number. Do you know where he lives? Maybe you could uh, maybe you could drive over there and get his number while I hold. No, I'm good. No, no. I'm, I command you. I command no, you to go I'm find good. his number. <laughs> go, go fetch his number for me. No, thank you. No, it's not a request. It's a command. I command you to fetch his number. Hello. Hey, where's Randy at? Give me, Hello? give me Randy's number. God damn it. Who is this? It's Roy. I'm Randy's best friend. I ain't got time for no goddamn uh, prank calls and shit, man. I don't call it no more. It's not a prank call. Why would you think this is a prank call? And hello? Yeah, he's gone. Let's break the rules and call one more time.
Oh, come on. <laughs> One more time. They hung up on me. Hey, Randy. Hey. Randy's got drugs Randy. for me. He promised me drugs. Hey. Can I buy drugs from you? What? What? Hello, ma'am? Hello? I just want drugs. That's all I want. I just want some drugs. Do you have any drugs? I think she just set the phone down again. They're back tracing me. Okay, I'm hanging up. <sighs> okay. More gym people. What? Ah. Hey. Whoa. Hey, Jack. Guess what? What do you want? Hey. What? I'm going to put a pistol to your head. I'm going to put a pistol crap. to your head. Crap. <laughs> crap, crap. What's up? Oh, nothing. What cool. do you want? Hey. Uh, just say hi. Oh. Uh, I was I was bored and just caught the caught your show online and I'm going to leave in like 2 minutes, so. Hi, yeah. Jag TV. <laughs> you What's never up? you never oh. called me back about doing a Walmart prank. Uh, I messaged you the other day. You didn't get it. Oh, maybe. I don't oh, know. I probably messaged the old one. Oh, you're stupid. I know. Well, we're going tonight for sure if you are if you want to do it. Yeah, yeah. Try and call me and see what happens. Alrighty. Uh, it'll probably be in about 15 minutes. Okay. Cool, cool. Alright. Bye. Talk to you Jag TV is always promising that he's going to go to Walmart and hang out there and while I prank someone and he videotapes the hilarious reactions. I don't think it'll ever happen, though. He's like a Stacy with his promises. The person you are trying to reach is not accepting calls at this time. That's weird. It's a live show, Knoxville. It's live. March 21st, 2014. Doing it live. Stephanie? Hello? Hey, Stephanie. Yes. Hey, can you hear me okay? Yes, I can. Oh, okay, great, because you sound like crap. Hey, I'm calling from the gym. This is Roy. You were here earlier today. Um, no, I wasn't. Where or where? That, that... Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, yeah. Why'd you say you weren't? Well, uh, your phone number says San Francisco, so um, I'm like, no, I'm not over there. No, but, I, th I think it okay. routes through the corporate office or something. Oh, yeah. Oh, but like you won the contest. You have the best camel toe of all of our customers. Oh, great. So you get like a free month of gym. Okay. For best camel toe. And next time you come in, we're going to take a Polaroid of your camel toe to put up on the wall with the rest of the awards. Well, that's fantastic. Yeah. Are, are you excited? Oh, um, yeah. I'm excited for you. So I know, how come, why, why is this contest going on? Why is it going on? Yeah. Oh, we just do fun things like this to kind of, you know, give back something to the customer. And, okay. And you just happen to be the winner for the whole year. Best Camel Great. Toe so, 2013. So how did he get my number? Yay! Because it's in the computer. It's because you're, you know, you're, 
you're, you're, you've got an account with us. Okay. Like, why wouldn't we have your number? <laughs> we require your number when you sign up. Yeah. So congratulations. Uh, make sure you wear right. something really nice when you come in next time so we can take a nice picture of your camel toe to put up on the wall. Sure. Yeah. And you guys are just odd. What do you mean we're odd? We're giving you a free month of gym. Okay. Why would you call us odd? That's like that's kind so of who, mean. We well, g we so give you who, something and you insult us. Well, who would be? Does that include like personal training? No, no, just a just a regular month, like a free month of gym okay. gym membership. So like you won't have so to how pay. Much is, you won't have to pay for next month. I'm not sure what you pay. I don't have your account pulled up. Can you pull it up? No, I don't feel like it. I just wanted to say yeah. congratulations. You're the winner. Yeah. Sure, you probably don't even work for 24. Woohoo! Winner! <laughs> so congratulations, and I'll, I'll let you go, but, you know, next time you're in here, I mean, take a picture and put it up on the wall, and everybody will know. Perfect. Just what I always wanted. Yep. I'm glad you're happy, because I'm happy for you. Yeah. Okay. Well, have a nice night, and we'll see you in, we'll see you in here next time. All right. Bye. Bye. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Sloth. I didn't have... I didn't get to say how many fingers. <laughs> I think before the night's over, we gotta call Tucker Mike back. I, I didn't delete his number because he was so hilarious. Knoxville wants me to talk about a poop stomp in the shower. I don't know what a poop stomp is, but it sounds hilarious. Oh, we got... Hello? You're on the air. You're on the air. Hello, person. I cannot hear you. Unmute your mic. Ah, my mic was mute. I'm on the air. Hey, who's this? Hello, it is Jayad. Hold on a second. I'm I got a fucking crazy echo going. There. Okay. What'd you say your name is? Now I hear more echoes. It's not me. I don't hear any echo. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? That's you playing around, isn't it? No, no, I'm not echoing. I swear. Now, okay. Oh, I thought I shut it off. Okay, that that was me. God. What the fuck is wrong with me? So who's this? Broken. Who are you? This is Jayad. Oh. This is my show. What are you doing? Jayad. <laughs> like, are you a Madhouse listener? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm that guy who comes around sometimes. I go by other names. Like, like I, I, go, I go by Laugh Track Matt oh. sometimes. I think I've and, heard of him. Yeah, and then other, other times I, I go as, like, Turbo. I see. And sometimes I do a show as as Turbo and Doctor Unk at the same time. It's it's kind of an interesting show. I've heard of all those people, just never Jiad. <laughs> Jiad is that what you guys call me? Oh, Jiad. Yeah, yeah, that Jiad there. Well, well, I thanks for covering for me. Oh, you're, you're welcome. That is very nice of you. Any, um, anything for you. Hold on, I gotta I gotta log into the chat room really quick because. Because everybody, I, I, as I, as I said, I was gonna be wrong because I was gonna, or I was gonna be wrong. I was gonna be gone because I was having a baby, and I did have a baby. Yay! Yeah, that's what I was waiting for. So I, I set out to have a baby, and I, and I had one. So good for me. Now here's the thing. Um, I'm gonna post a picture. Jaya's baby's gonna go up in the, in a room. It's a boy. It's a boy. And. Uh, here, I'm gonna go ahead. And Yay! It. It's a boy. And, and can I ask you something? Can I ask you something, Brad? Uh, sure. When was the last time you were in Michigan? Just, just curious. Uh, like 2002, I think, or maybe uh, 2001. 
Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm thinking you were here a little bit sooner. A little bit sooner. Does it look, you, does it look like me? Link? A little bit. Oh. This is my link. Let's see if my link even works. Yeah, my link works. I don't know. It, it looks more like you than it looks like me. That's oh. what I'm pretty sure. He's got the mustache. <laughs> That is an un uncanny resemblance. <laughs> my my my. Uh, I mean, that's obviously not photoshopped either. You see how the hat, the head looks like it's sitting in the hat, and the hand slightly goes in front of the chin. I mean, you can't do that with Photoshop. No, I mean, it's not. <laughs> Photoshop's can do a lot of things, but it's not magic. <laughs> so I had a lady taking pictures for me. And I was going to try to make a weird expression, and I realized this nurse is going to think I'm a fucking weirdo, so I'm going to do a selfie. <laughs> so, no, anyways, I have another boy. I thought I would make a funny little picture. So thanks to all the people who said congratulations. And uh, I probably won't be back next week. Things are still a little offset. He is He can't eat and breathe at the same time right now, which uh, I guess isn't like a completely... That's tough to do. I have problems with that myself. <laughs> well, he's so he's actually got an IV in him. They're feeding him that way and trying to teach him to go ahead and breathe while he eats because otherwise when he eats, he starts turning purple. So we're still at the hospital. While I'm at home, my wife told me to go home because he was going to be in the nursery all night. I didn't feel like sleeping on a really comfortable couch there anymore. Ah, so, yeah. So you could just do a show tonight. You should just take over. I could, but I told my wife that I wouldn't because I can't stay up all night because i got to go back up. She's like, God damn it, you're not allowed to have fun tonight. <laughs> yep. I'm at the hospital. Yeah. Yeah. So, anyways, that's just me reporting in. Oh. Um, do I need numbers? No, Nova, I don't need numbers. I'm not doing a show. <laughs> Stupid Nova. Yep. I'm sick of his bullshit. But, but RBCP needs numbers, tons of them. Just keep messaging them. And message them one number at a time, like not one full number at a time, just one number at a time. So if it's, it starts with a 276, send them a 2, and then wait like three minutes and then send them a 7. That's the easiest way, because <laughs> if they go too fast, it confuses me. <laughs> All right. All right, well, I'm going to listen to your show, and it's probably later than I'm supposed to, but... I'll let you keep rolling. Thank you for all the funny me. stuff's already happened, so you've missed everything good. Did it? Hey, did you want any? I I looked at my email today. I hadn't looked in a while. If you want any of the um, hypnosis numbers, you can have some. But uh, if, you've got, if you already got shit planned, no bother. I've got a big list of gem numbers. And none of them are going to pick up, just like last time. <laughs> going to be just phone ringing. Yep, <laughs> that's my favorite kind of show. <laughs> all right. Uh, well, okay. Con congratulations and thank you, thank you. Stuff and, and so now, now we're going to hear two kids screaming when I'm trying to do a show. And yay. My wife getting mad because I won't stop doing the show. Two like kids. I said, I won't be back next week, but I'm, I'm gonna try for the following week. So. Two kids knows, and a grandfather clock. Yep. <laughs> but and the thing is, I do have, I do have up to Thursday off. Maybe I'll jump on on somebody's day show this week. Who knows? Okay. So, all right. I'll do one just for you to jump in on. <laughs> All right. Thanks for thanks for covering for me. I didn't want to get fired. And yeah. Somebody yeah. needs to fill me in on this. We're on Prank Nation now. I'm sitting there. Shit, man. He said he was going to start at ten. Fucking forty five <laughs> minutes later, I'm going. All right. I better message him. <laughs> yeah, I got on the old one for a while, the old Mixler, and just to announce to everyone that oh, okay. there's a new Mixler. But must be before I turned it on. Yeah. Sucks to be you. You missed all the yeah. good stuff. Missed all the good stuff. Oh, well, I like the sound of phone ringing. So it's relaxing. So. Yeah. Well, congratulations. <laughs> right. Thank you. I will talk to you later. Have a good show. You t uh, Yeah, bye. Bye. Yeah. Yay, Gia. <laughs> I have no idea who that was, for real. Like, no idea. Some weirdo. Everyone thinks I'm supposed to know them. And okay, so Jag TV wants me to call Walmart, even though right now it's time for the break. It's past time for the break. Maybe we'll just skip the break. Let me let me talk to Jag TV real quick. Hi, him. I 
wonder if Jag TV can even listen. Like, is he listening to the show right now? Ah, okay. He's not even there yet. He's giving me the numbers, but he's not there yet. Okay, so let's... Uh, he says he'll call me when he gets there. Let, let's take a small music break. So, for the small music break, uh, I'm sorry, YouTube people, but I have to mute you. Uh, you're going to just hear silence for the next five to seven minutes while I play music, because uh, YouTube will kick me off. So, goodbye, YouTube. We'll see you in seven minutes. You're listening to, listening to the Prank Call Nation Network Machine. Hello. Hello. At prankcallnation.com. Okay, I'm back. Uh, Jag TV says still five minutes until he's ready in Walmart, so I guess I will try and call more gym people. Or, let's see. I forget which ones I've called. Did I call someone named Sean yet? Let's find out. I'll just call it. And if they start yelling at me, I know I called them. <sighs> Palindrome wants me to call a VPN guy back. Who's a VPN guy? What is that? Hello? Hey, Sean. It's, Hello? It's, it's Roy from the gym. Roy? Yeah, Roy from the gym. You were here earlier today? Remember? Continue. Were, were you here earlier today? Okay. I don't know a Roy. Well, I don't work at the front desk. You probably had Haley check you in. Okay. You know Haley? Maybe. Why are we calling me? What do you mean, maybe? Like, why, why are you being so weird about this? Because it's a phone number from California, then you're not somebody I know. Okay, well, when we make calls, it, it routes through the corporate office, and it comes up as a weird number. Okay. So I'm sorry that's so disturbing to you, okay? Okay, so what's, what's going on? Well, I'm calling about what you did in the bathroom when you were here earlier. <laughs> Interesting. I never went to the bathroom. No, you were in the bathroom. We showed on our security tapes. <laughs> All right, who is this? You, you took a shit in the urinal. <laughs> really? I'm glad you find it amusing, because I sure don't. Well, hey, if I did, if I didn't do it, but you know what, I'll claim it. Yes, I did. All right. It was, it was fucking huge. Okay, well, I'm glad you're ready to admit it, at least. <laughs> So is there anything else? No, that's all. I just I, I was hoping you could apologize. Can you apologize at least? Oh, no. I'm proud of it. Oh, uh, well, we're going to ban you from being in the bathroom anymore, I think. <laughs> really? Yep. Well, you better get a whole bunch of fucking guys. Because if you know who I am... <laughs> oh, yeah, you think you're pretty no. tough, don't you? <laughs> sure. Hold on, Jag TV's calling in. Hey, Jag, are you ready? Uh, yeah, we're talking right now. Uh, we figured we'd give you some time for the whole music or whatever. Oh, okay. No, I'm, I'm ready whenever you are. Okay. I'm just talking to the Sean asshole. I'm sorry? I, I said I'm talking to the Sean asshole. Oh. <laughs> I, I Sean asshole. What, what's that? Uh, Yo, Bob says cunt. Oh. Hey, Sean. What? Cunt. Yeah. Cunt? <laughs> Is that what you said? Cunt? Yep. No, I didn't. Uh, Yo Bob said that. Yeah, Yo Bob said that. <laughs> oh, open your Yo fucking Bob. ears. <laughs> All right, you better hurry up. We're almost All right, ready. Sean, I'm canceling your account, Sean. Goodbye. You're not welcome in here anymore. Cancel. <laughs> I'm canceled. I'm canceled. <laughs> All right, bye. Wow. I he was one of the like PLA guys. I didn't know he was a. No, he's just some customer, and he's really happy about the call. Oh, nice. And, I don't know. It was pretty weird. Yeah, it is kind of packed. Oh, you're talking about the, the yeah, I got this. Let's just steal that car. That'll be a thing. Yeah. Go. 
Alright, uh, Yo Bob has something to say to you. Okay. Yeah. What am I saying? How long you had this lunch? I ate at Arby's today. Okay, that's great. Like, I care. <laughs> whatever. He says, he says that's great, whatever. Alright, this is boring. Bye. Damn, Sean, he ruined my prank call by thinking it's hilarious. I would have talked to him longer, but that was really bad sound quality in there. So... I'm going to try another one. Maybe. I don't know. I think Jag might be on the way to Walmart. I don't really know what to say up, say to Walmart. You know, to, to upset them. Hopefully, I don't know, maybe I can get a customer on or like I did with Roxy, with Stacy. I don't need more numbers. I have shitloads of numbers here. I have like at least close to 20. So I'm going to call one while I'm waiting for Jag TV. Never, Jillian. Never. Never. Hello? Hey, could I talk to Aaron? This is him. Oh, it's spelled E-R-I-N, though. Are you sure this is Aaron? That's like a girl's name. Like, if you're Aaron, it should be A-A-R-O-N. <laughs> that didn't work out. Who is this? Hey, this is Roy from the gym. You were in here earlier? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, um, there was just a problem with the, you know, you were on one of the machines. Um, okay. If it was really you, I mean, it says E-R-I-N on the computer here. Is that really your name? You're not checking in on someone else's account, are you? No. Oh, okay. Well, you broke the machine. What? You, you broke the machine, and you're going to have to pay for it. We're going to, like, charge your account. Um, no. The number you're calling from is, like, San Francisco. I'm in Missouri. Right. That's where our corporate office is. When I make a phone call through this location, it routes to the corporate office, and that's why you see that number. What do you mean I broke the machine? Oh, so now you believe me. Okay, thanks. Um, yeah, it's just you broke it. You, you were too rough. You rough-handled it. It's completely yeah, messed up. It. You're not buying it? Why not? Um, uh, first of all, my name isn't spelled E-R-I-N. Well, that's what it says on the computer here. E-R-I-N. <laughs> right, I gotta go. I gotta go. Jag, Jag TV is gonna make loud noises at me, so I gotta go. I'm uh, blaming him. I'm Jack. Okay, so what are we doing? Alright, um... There's a guy that just walked in auto care. So if you call the tire and lube place, okay, we should be able to fuck with him. Uh, okay. It'd be it'd be nice if you could transfer yourself to uh, not transfer yourself, get transferred to uh, the fuck's it, sports and leisures. Well, I thought it was tire and lube. Is yeah, try try tire and lube because I think yeah. someone's over there. Well, is it tire and lube or is it sports? It's tire, tire and lube. Okay, all right. Should I hang up on you, or, or are you gonna listen? Or um, I'm gonna listen. Okay. Thank you for calling the Walmart Tire and Lube Express. Can you hear it ringing over there? I'm gonna go over and check. Yeah, I can hear it. Hold on. I have an idea. So, like, the employee in the next aisle and say, oh, hey, the auto and lube phone's ringing. <laughs> oh, 
Cool, cool. It's in the auto. That's convenient. Uh, I'm on the front on the phone with my dad. Shut up, son. Nobody cares. Then I hung up on Aaron. Um, I think the guy's gonna think that you're calling him. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. Okay. Is Tire and Lube even open this late at night? Yeah. Because it's almost midnight, know. right? Right. Yeah. yeah, the red light was going off. I don't know about that, but um, on that phone over there, I don't know. Does that mean someone's calling in, or I don't know? I just had a. Okay, so you think that'd be good for 2000? Yeah. I'm hanging up and calling right back. Okay, yeah, I have no idea. Thank he, you for calling the Walmart Tire and Move Express. I don't know. I know. Sorry, just give me one second. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, the thing's doing it again. I don't know. The red light's going on and off. <sighs> so should I call the main number and ask for sporting goods? Yeah, do that, I guess. Are there people around sporting goods? Are there customers around there? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, most uh, all make models. Okay. Okay, cool. Here goes. Yeah, if it'll work with anything, then he's on his way, so I'm just waiting for him. You know. But yeah, I think I appreciate it. I, I don't know. I don't know anything about. Thank you stuff. for calling Walmart. <laughs> all right. Thank you. Are you going to be filming? If, if I mean, if they pick up. Yeah, that guy didn't really give a shit about the the phone in there. He's just like, oh. what a jerk. I know. What the fuck? <laughs> I would think Tyron Lube would close kind of early. Yeah. Um, and not be open at midnight. There's people. There's, there's, uh, I don't know why the hell it keeps ringing. Sports and Leisure's number? I don't know. I'm, I'm not on the computer right now. Yeah, this is weird. I don't know what's going on. I hear the auto and lube phone ringing still. What? I'm not calling anymore. I, don't... I hear something. You know, that's probably you. Yeah, I'm calling the main store number, if this is really the main store number. Could be. I copied and pasted it. Fuck. Yeah, I just looked it up on Google. That's the main store number. Same thing? Hmm. Yeah, I hear a phone ringing somewhere over here. Like, follow the phone ring. Hold on a second. Answer the phone! Thank you for calling Walmart. I should do it. They won't suspect you at all now. No, I'm running now. You'll bump. <laughs> Just get on a phone and say, uh, Sporting Goods, you have a call on 2539. What am I doing now? Get on a paging phone. Page the store and say, Sporting Goods, you have a call on line two. It'll work. <laughs> I'm sure. Damn it. There's a phone. I hear a phone ringing in the... Yeah, I can hear in the background. No, nobody, I wasn't yelling. Nobody cares. 
There's the field. I don't know. That wasn't me. Okay. No, I'm on the phone with Dad. I think this is a big failure. Okay. I think it's they're not going to pick up. Yeah. I don't think the employees give shit here. Yeah, I hear it ringing. Can you hear it in the background? Yeah, yeah. I just now hung up, so it should stop. Yeah, even that lady was like, just looking, hey, does, are you on the phone? Is that what you're yelling? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> I, I would never yell in public. I'm a Christian. Of course. <laughs> Well, damn it. Um, well, see, I, guess, I, I hung up like at least 10 seconds ago and it's still ringing, so... Still ringing, yeah. Well, that's weird. Maybe someone else is calling. I don't know. Um, Maybe it's it's well, because of the delay for uh, the prank call network. It's not yeah, as fast as, as the old Madhouse network. Yeah, that's got to be it. Well, um, damn it. I guess we'll have to either try again in the daytime or... Fuck around with some other business. Yeah, during the daytime. Someone yep, says I'm down for some, someone whatever. says you should go to Target. Oh, Target's closed. They close at ten. Fucking uh. assholes. Okay. Yeah, we. Uh, damn it. Yeah, I don't know. Well, thanks for nothing. Yeah, you know. Hey, at least I tried, right? Yeah, that's true. It, it'll be fun. Uh, we'll we'll get it to work someday. Yeah, I'm up for anything. I don't give a shit if I get arrested. Okay. It'll be the time. Oh, really? Okay. Well, okay. Let's let's do something right now. Um. The employees don't give a shit. I want you to go to the um, uh, auto department, and we're going to get a uh, brake fluid, and then we're going to need some ammonia. Ah, oh, okay, okay. Oh, wait, hold on. Someone's in the iron lube. It doesn't look like an employee. Okay. He's fucking he's peering in the windows. He, oh, he's trying to rob the place. Oh, cool. No, I don't, but, yeah, let's get some, uh, some uh, gasoline and styrofoam. That'll be fun. Yes. What All right. This? Well, okay. Damn. Thanks for nothing. You're welcome. <laughs> that was Jag TV wasting our time for five minutes. Thanks, Jag TV. Thanks for nothing. So I guess we're just gonna listen to phone ring phones ring for a little bit longer. Let's call let's call Tucker Mike back. We'll just tell him it was a joke. Because he was so upset before. I, I wanna set things straight with Tucker Mike. I feel bad for Tucker Mike. What? Hey, I just want to apologize for earlier. Seriously, dude? Do you know what time it is here? Well, can I like, talk? Who are you, and why are you calling? I'm I'm at the gym. Can I talk to Tucker, Mike? Who is this? It's Roy from the gym. Can Can I just talk to Tucker, Mike? Please. Is he all tuckered out? Hello? You forgot to say just a minute, please. You're supposed to say that when you go off to get someone for me. Hello? Hey, Tucker Mike. Hey, I just wanted to apologize for earlier, because, you know, I was kind of a jerk. And, I mean, you were kind of a jerk, too, but I shouldn't be a jerk. I should be professional. Boy, do you know what time it is? Uh, let's see. Uh, you're in the central time zone. It is 9, 10, 10, 42 p.m. Don't call my fucking house again. Do you understand me? Well, I just want to apologize. I'm just Do not fucking call my house again. I'm just apologizing. I don't give a fuck, motherfucker. Don't you dare call my fucking house again. Tucker, Mike, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I love Tucker, Mike. I hope Carlito's listening so he can see what Tucker Mike's really like in real life. Alright, let's call Mike. It's a different Mike this time. It's not Tucker Mike. It's Zimmer Mike. Oh, wait. Uh, Carlita just messaged me and let, he, let, let, let me know that he's listening. So, yay, he got to hear what Tucker Mike's 
is like when he's not calling into the, into the show. The real Tucker Mike. Hi, you've reached the Zimmers. We're not available. Leave your name and number. And we'll... It's not even that late. It's not even 11 o'clock where Tucker Mike is. It's freaking out at me. The person you have dialed can't take your call now. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, simply hang up or um, press the pound um. key for further options. Hold on a second. I have to answer a PM. Copy and paste stuff to a PM. And by the way, I'm copying and pasting from one computer to the other, thanks to the miraculous software known as, uh, shit, what was it called? I forget now. Synergy that a user told me to start using, and I use it, and Carlito uses it now, and some other people in the chat room use it, and it's amazing. Everyone should use Synergy to use two computers at once. Sloth is trying to take credit for this guy's discovery. Nice try, Sloth, but whatever. Just just be happy that someone else recommended something to me that was really awesome. You don't have to be jealous that it wasn't you. Hello? Oh, Kelly. Yes? Hey, I'm calling from the gym. This is Roy. You were in here earlier today? Yeah. And um, there, uh, you won the contest. What contest? Do, do you remember entering the contest last year? No. Oh, well, uh, you're the winner for 2013 uh, Best Camel Toe. Who is this? Congratulations. Yeah, you. Um, next time you come in, we're going to take a snapshot of your camel toe and put it up on the wall with all the others. And you've... <laughs> I need to think of something better to say to people. No more camel toe on the show tonight. Hi, Bruce Brian. Hope you're having a great day. Please leave your name. Hmm. <sighs> We're sorry, you have reached a number that. I do not love you, Royal Guard. I hate you, Royal Guard. Eat shit, Royal Guard. You didn't miss anything, Sinks. It's been really boring tonight. Just like all my weekend night shows are anymore. So if I'm still been forwarded to an automatic voice message system three one. If I'm still doing this, like an hour from now, we have to call Tucker Mike one more time. 
I'll call him from a different number. I'll call him from the gym's number. In fact, I should do that right now. I should... This next batch of gym numbers, I'm going to attempt to spoof caller ID. That never goes well because my stupid soft phone likes to... Um, ah, wrong thing. It, it just sometimes it won't connect, and I don't know why. So, let's see. Um, Got to remember how to do this. There it is. And this next batch of people will have no doubt that I'm calling from the gym, because I have the gym's phone number on their caller ID, if it works. Oh, give me one second. got to set one more thing up. Make sure my sound settings are correct. And they're not. Okay, time to give this a try. forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Six one eight five three ah, zero. No, no, seven, no, no, eight. don't. <laughs> okay, I'm using a new software for the soft for the Aster's phone, and I didn't know how to hang it up. It is Verizon ring back tone while your party is reached. Yes. She got the boogie. I'm going to silence that, because YouTube yelled at me for copyrighted music when I played a ringtone the other day. Damn you, Marla. Hi, you've reached Marla Not. I am not uh, near my phone right now. I think she's there. It is Verizon ring back tone while your party is reached. She got Hi, you've reached Marla Not. I am not uh, near my phone. She hit the button that time, so that means I gotta call her one more time. She hit the fuck you button. It is Verizon ring back tone while your party is reached. Still ringing. Hi, you've reached Marla Not. I am not uh, near my phone right now, so... Balls. All right. No answer. No answer. This is another gym in an uppity area. You know, kind of like a rich area kind of people that's going to threaten me with lawyers and stuff. Hello? Hey, Todd. Yes? It's Roy from the gym. You were here earlier today. I'm sorry? It's Roy from the gym. You you were at the gym earlier today? 
Yeah. Hey, how are you doing? Doing good. That's good. Not sure who this is. Oh, my name is Roy. You got on a machine today, and I was on the machine next to you. Remember? I think you may have the wrong phone number. I'm not sure. Oh, well, is this Todd Husak? Yes, this is. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was you. Yeah, the uh, uh, Berkeley. She works at the front desk, and she's uh, that's my sister, and she gave me your uh, all your information from the computer. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, so I, I noticed you picked the machine next to me, even though there were other machines that were available that weren't next to me, so I figured that meant you liked me. So do you want to go out sometime? All right, you're weird, dude. What's weird about this? What do you mean I'm weird? That's really rude. Why, why are you calling me weird? Well, how about this? How about you go ahead and meet me out in front of the gym right now? Oh, are you close by? I'm like five minutes from there. So how do you know Berkeley? Uh, she's my sister. Interesting. All right. Well, yeah. but you know, like, get rid of my number, you freak. Well, Later. no, no. We 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 we, sh we shared a moment today at the gym. <laughs> what the hell? Hey, Todd. It's Roy again. Yeah, I'm recording your phone conversation right now, so oh. go ahead and keep talking. Can I record yours as well? You can do whatever you want. Okay, thanks. So what's your problem? What, what's your what's your big problem? You got, a, got nothing to do on a Friday night? Basically, yeah. No, I don't. I was, okay, so, so, so what, do, what do you want? I, I want to know. Being a little fucking, okay, quit being a little fucking pussy, and why don't you fucking tell me who you are, you little pussy yeah, ass motherfucker? I, I told you it's Roy. Hello, I'm, tell me. I'm Burke's Come brother. On, tell me who you are, you little faggot. I I've told you I'm Burke's brother. Berkeley's brother. My ass, yeah. you're Berkeley's brother. What? Why do you say that? You, you think you know Berkeley? Why are you calling me on an eight hundred number? What are you talking about? I'm calling from the gym. Fag. Hey, you little faggot. What's your, what the fuck's your problem? Everyone's calling me a faggot tonight. Hey, I don't understand why. Hey, hey, little, hey, little douchebag. That's bad. How about you? Uh, how about you give me your real phone number so I can actually call the cops on you? And actually, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to call the police officers right after we get off the phone. I'm going to have them tap this line and figure out what 800 number you're calling from. That sounds like a waste of their time. Hmm. <laughs> don't you think? What what toll free number do you see on the caller ID? Because I I thought that I think that's weird because I'm calling from a local. You're a fucking number. loser, dude. Go to hell. Go to hell. Go fuck yourself. Re read the toll free number to me. Go fuck yourself. Go to f go fuck yourself, you douchebag. Okay. Why I don't you get a life and go do something different with your, your Friday fucking night? I, I just I'm trying to get a date. <laughs> hey, don't you, hey, you want to hey, go hey, out with me? Hey, you little pussy. Come on, hey, you little fucking pussy. Please. Who the fuck, who the fuck are you? Who I'm the fuck lonely. Are you? I'm Roy still. Who, who the fuck My name's are you? Still you Roy. Real, you fucker. Come on, what's the toll free number? I'm really curious about that. And he's gone. Crap. Crap, they're going to tap my phone. Okay, I'm going to call my cell phone. And let's see what number comes up on my cell phone. Why would it come up toll free? Oh look at that! It's um, that's T Mul. Uh, that's uh, AT and T's number. <sighs> um, laptop, soft phone. I've got the right one. That's that's what I had it set to before. All right, let me try that one more time. Call my cell phone again. I'm using a soft phone called Blink. There. Now it's the right number. It's the correct... It's the gym number coming up now. So I don't know. I guess I forgot to hit the, you know, the save button or whatever.
So people were getting the toll-free number instead of the gym's number. Man. Todd's a homophobe. <laughs> Call him back with the gym number. No, I don't want to get tapped. My phone's going to get tapped. He's calling the police right now. Is the Ragon ring back, Dylan, while you're part oh, of your Yes. I just like uh, I'm not able to take your phone call, so uh, leave your name and number. Not balls. Let me turn. Oh crap! Hold on. Let me. Let me actually call from the soft phone this time. I'm in such a habit of calling from Skype that I always forget. So, okay, this time I'm calling from the soft phone. Yes, Blink is a free program. Most soft phones seem to be free. Hey, Mike, Michael. Yes. It's Roy from the gym. You were here earlier today. Uh, yes. Okay, yeah, and um, you you were on like which machine were you on? Oh, uh, I wasn't on any of them. I was actually in the pool. In the what? In the pool. Yeah. Cause we saw on the camera, yeah. like you know, we have cameras in the pool area, right? Right. And you you pooped in the pool. No, I did not. You, Who's this? We saw it on the camera, and you were the only person in that area when it happened. And uh, you, you just, no. You just no, was not. turned around and pretended that it didn't happen. Uh, yeah, it did not happen. Maybe you just didn't realize it happened? Maybe you just pooped yeah. and didn't know it? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It clogged the filter, though. Mm -hmm. And we're having to drain the pool tonight and refill it. Mm -hmm. And it's gonna cost a lot of money. Mm -hmm. We're gonna charge okay. it. We're gonna charge it to your account. Okay, you do that. We will. Just watch. I don't see what's what the attitude. I mean, you're the one that did something wrong, not me. He hung up. <laughs> and a kid thought it was a baby Ruth. Is what the fucker says. All right, he was boring. He knew it was a prank. Whatever. Eight numbers left. Eight numbers to go, and then we're gonna call Tucker Mike back. <laughs> okay, George. That's what I'll do. Dash, yeah, I accidentally closed your, your This mic. is Jack. Hey, Hello? hey, Jack. Who's this? That was weird. You sounded like a voicemail or something. Oh, no, no. This is Jack. Oh, okay. What's going on? It's Roy from the gym. You were in the gym earlier? Yeah, I was. And um, we, it, it's, They're saying that you're going too fast on the equipment and it's breaking it? <laughs> I wish. I wish. No, I'm serious. Like they're they're saying said that. the manager's saying he wants you to pay for a new machine. Uh, well, I, I'm sure Frank would tell me that in person. <laughs> yeah, but he wasn't here today. It was just Berkeley. Uh, well, she doesn't she doesn't really count, so I have to give her uh, a break. Okay, well, I'm glad you think this is a big joke, but you know, one of our machines is broken now, thanks to you. Oh uh, well, I'm glad to, I could do my part. You're gonna have to pay for it. All right. Yeah, well, pay for it. God damn it. I'll have to God I damn know. it all to hell. Well, I'll, I'll bring... Do what? I said, God damn it all to hell. Exactly. <laughs> well, I guess I have Frank write me a bill. I'll bring in a credit card tomorrow. Okay, great. Enjoy your weed. <laughs> I wish if I had some, I would. All right. Bye. Bye. Ruining everything by not being mad at me. 
Who the hell doesn't get mad at that? Bullshit. Bullshit. I would call Tucker Mike right now, but he is at a different gym, so I have to change my caller ID again for him. Hey, we should call the gym after all this and say, hey, have you got any angry phone calls? But I'll make my caller ID from the other gym, and I'll say, oh, we're just bored here, and we thought we'd prank our, prank the other location. Yeah. That's what'll happen. It's brilliant. Ah, I'm getting texts or something. Oh, it's just Samantha. I thought I blocked her. Ah, ah, damn it, Samantha, you just turned my music off. And now that she knows that that happened, she's going to keep messaging me, and I, ah, uh, fucking Android. Wait, no, wrong thing, wrong thing. Need music. Okay. Thanks for that, Samantha. Facebook.com slash the Samantha. Okay, really, what should I call what should I say to the next person? I, I suck at this tonight. I don't know what to say to these people. Now I know how to turn it off. Show notifications off. Take that, Samantha. Hi, you've reached Landon. Leave a message. <sighs> Landon. wants me to say they left their pubes all over the machine. The fucker says they, I need to say they didn't lose enough weight and they're banned because of that. Uh, someone else said they won boner of the year. This guy's on the phone. They pooped in the drain. Hi, this is Larry. Thanks for calling. Hi, Larry. <sighs> okay, what else? Hi, this is Larry. Thanks for calling. Uh, stupid Larry. Five more left, and then the show's over. I'm 
Stop repeating yourself. Is this live? God. Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Three, one. Hey, let's do a, a latency test real quick. There's currently 90 people listening on Mixler, 68 people on YouTube, and 59 people on Shoutcast. So if you're listening on Shoutcast, hit number one really, really fast. One, 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 one. One, enter, one, enter, one, enter. If you're listening on the other thing, Mixler, two, hit number two. Number two, really fast. Two, two, two. And if you're on uh, YouTube, hit number three. Hit three, enter, three, enter, three, enter. So, shoutcast one, 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 mixer two, 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 <laughs> and and YouTube three, number three, over and over and over, three, 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 three. Wow, the, the chat room is really emptying out all of a sudden. I don't understand why. <laughs> That's really strange. <laughs> I don't get it. Yeah, um, YouTube's the worst. You know, it's really slow, so they're going to just start hitting threes any second now. <laughs> they're like a minute behind, I think. <laughs> Sorry, Enigma. <laughs> Get ready for the threes. Let's all LOL when all the threes happen. They still haven't happened. So if nobody noticed, that was just a joke to uh, get you kicked out of the room. Tee-hee! <laughs> Hi, you've reached Emily Emerson with Coldwell Banker Gundaker. Oh, great. Four more left. Where the hell are all the threes? I think you two people figured it out because of all the other kicks. Hi, you've reached Emily Emerson with Coldwell. Oh, she, she hit the fuck you button. You've reached Emily. Ugh, stupid Emily. Yeah, go ahead and fire me, Enigma and Carlito. I'll just move over to, to Friday Night Crank's new network. I'll be on their network. Their network that's called the Prank Show. Prank Show something. The Prank Show Nation. PrankShowNation.com. I'll just move to that network. See how you like that. Hello? Hey, Susan. Yeah. It's Roy from the gym. Yes. And um there's a you were in here earlier today. Yes. There's there's kind of a problem. There's like several people have commented about how smelly you are. And I was just wondering, uh -huh. can you, can you try not to be so smelly when you come in? I'll give it my best shot. Okay. I'd really appreciate it because it makes okay. everyone uncomfortable and sick. and. Yeah, yeah. Just stop being so goddamn gross. I will do that. Okay. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> have a nice night. Okay. So she thinks it's a prank, but then she's going to look at the caller ID and type it into Google and be like, oh my god, that was really the gym. What the hell? Oh, crap. Was she still listening? Crap, crap, crap. All right, two more. Two left. 
And it's 9.13. It's time for a break. I need a break. Hello? Hi, Penny. Yes. It's Roy from the gym. Okay, yes. And you were in here earlier today? Yes, I was. And, and everyone keeps complaining because, like, when you're working out, you're, like, grunting a bunch. Like, making all these grunts. Excuse me? Making all these grunting sounds. I don't and, think so. Well, no, definitely. It's, like, several people are saying that lady over there, and they're pointing. And I don't grunt. Well, maybe you're just not aware of it? No, I don't grunt. Okay, well, no, I'm not here to judge you or anything. I just hoping maybe you could keep it down in the future. Because, I mean, it's really... I mean, I, I went over there and listened, and I could definitely hear you grunting. You know, I do not appreciate this phone call, and I will be telling Frank about it. Frank's the one that had me call. Like, Goodbye. He, he knows about the grunting. We all know about the grunting, ma'am. All right, I'm back. I'm back. Somebody was at the door. It was Drunk Bill. He tried to stab me in the face. <sighs> yes, I had to go ejaculate because I was so excited about telling that girl that she was grunting. Okay, who did I call last? Was that Penny? Is Penny the grunter? Hello? Penny, why'd you hang up on me? You need to stop calling here. I, why? It's 11.20 at night. I know. Stop, but... stop calling here. Okay, stop grunting at me for one thing, all right? I don't appreciate it. <laughs> okay, never mind. One call left. One number left. Uh, this guy's name is Major. Like, his first name is Major. Is that a real first name? Hello? Hey, Major. Yes? Hey, it's Roy from the gym. You were here earlier today? Oh, yeah, what's up? Hey. Yeah, what's up? Oh, yeah, we keep getting complaints. Everyone says you're grunting too much when you're working out. Can can you maybe stop grunting? Grunting too? Yeah, you know. What is, just... what is that? I haven't, what? <laughs> oh, you know, like when you're working out and, you know, you're all sweaty and everything, you're grunting a bunch. I don't think you're aware that you're doing it, but you keep grunting. No, I, I haven't I haven't been there in uh, a minute. <laughs> You're there I was up there. To, I was up there today playing basketball, but I haven't worked out there in a minute. Yeah, no, that's what I'm saying. During basketball, you keep grunting. Everyone's like, "What's, all that, what's all that grunting coming from that room? What is that?" I don't, I don't even know, man. <laughs> oh, well, can you just stop? I don't even, stop. I don't even know. Try to be more. I don't, I don't even. Huh? I don't even grunt. I don't even. Know, I don't even think I grunt, man. <laughs> I, I think you're just not aware of it. Like maybe you're just doing it and you don't realize you're doing it. But just try and be more. Aware of your grunting whenever you're working out and and playing basketball and stuff. Okay, but well, I'm pretty sure I don't grunt. But okay, I, well, I, no, I you, you do that. grunt because I I heard you and it's really disturbing and and I don't know, it's really, it's kind of gross. Just stop grunting, all right? Oh, somebody talking about my grunt, man. Like I only grunt when I when I play basketball. Man. Here, I'm I'm gonna add know, bro. I'm gonna hey, add a grunting. Call me out. I'm I'm adding a grunting fee of, onto your account. It is it's a call me out of nowhere saying that I grunt. Well no, it's yeah, true. Yeah, I grunt like a lot. Apparently I grunt a lot when I play basketball. Who are you talking to? Is, there, is that your boyfriend? Is that my who? Who's who are you talking to? You said is that my boy? No, oh. no, I didn't say that. You misunderstood me. No, you said boyfriend, bro. No, I didn't. I wouldn't insult you like that. I, I'm 100% against gay people, and I. Yeah. 
Bro, you just said it. <laughs> no, you're hearing things. Like, not only do you no, not I'm hear not yourself. No, I'm not hearing anything. You just said it. Is that your boyfriend? Well, well is, is it? <laughs> what? Is it? No, what you mean, is it? I'm not gay. <laughs> well, the, the, rate, the way you grunt all the time, it sounds pretty gay. You said what, bro? The way that you're always grunting when you're here, it, it makes you sound pretty gay. <laughs> Bro, who is this for real, though, man? It's Roy. Who is this for real, though, bro? It, it's Roy from the gym. Frank asked me to call you. Who? Frank, the manager here. Listen, yeah, you're... I want to know who this is, you're, bro, because I know ain't nobody in so no, 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 uh... What's, what you call them things? Uh, members. Members? You know, you know what I'm saying? Wait, is this more gay talk? Like, is it... I said, now you disrespect. Now, now I gotta come up there, bro. Why? Why do you need to? Because because you because you disrespecting me, bro. Oh, like I, I that, that it's, it's that hard to respect cool. you the way you're. That ain't cool, man. The way you're grunting at all the gay people here. What? Just, it's, a, it's a gay gym now. <laughs> well, no, you just you, you just said there's a lot of gay people there. Yeah, well, there is. There is. I don't, what what gym is this? What gym is this? Do you have a problem with gay people? No, I don't have a problem with gay people at all. Well, why are you grunting just, at them? I'm just you're, you're insulting me, saying that I'm gay. <laughs> oh, so gay gay is an insult? Is that what it is? No, when you insult someone that's not gay, what you, you mean you're giving all the gay people boners? That's the problem. What? I'm giving all gay people bon what? The what the? What is I this never, talking about? Bro? No, I never even said you that. Just said I give up. I didn't say that at all. You're just you're making things up now. You said what? I you're making things up. I never said anything like that. Like, bro, you, so you did not just say that I'm I'm giving gay people boners. What is that? What you just? Is, is, no, no I said nothing said. like that. I said nothing like that. I said Frank needs. Are you to, sure? I said Frank needs you sure? to talk because I'm I'm recording the whole conversation. Oh, can you play some of it back to prove to me that you're recording it? Because that sounds like a huge lie. It was a huge lie. Okay, see, <laughs> I'm glad you can admit it. <laughs> I'm just saying, bro. You you still insulted me, bro. Oh, okay. Like like I need to come up there or something. Listen, don't be ashamed about being gay. It's all right, you know. Just just. What you like, mean? Don't be ashamed about being gay. Ain't no nigga. Ain't nobody gay over here, nigga. What you mean? I got a whole bitch. <laughs> You don't need to be ashamed of it. Be proud. Be a proud gay man. Be proud of what, nigga? I'm not gay. <laughs> See, not, nah, not. Nah, I think I do need to come up there. I'll be up there in like ten minutes. Okay, why? Why are you gonna come up here? Are you gonna grunt at because us some more? You're insulting me, bro. And I just gotta com confront your manager. Well, the manager's not even here. Frank comes in in the mornings. Well, I will be there in the morning. Good. I will confront your manager. I can't wait. And I will tell him. That you're insulting me over the phone. Make sure you remind him that you're the guy that grunts, yeah, uh, mi grunts mi all Mr. the time. Mr. Roy. Yeah, I, I, make sure what? I, make sure you let him know that you're the guy that grunts all the time, and he'll know exactly who you are. Make make sure make sure he knows that I'm the guy that grunts. Boy, I don't grunt. No, don't call me boy. I don't grunt. Don't call me boy. I don't grunt. Don't call me boy. Don't call me gay. Don't call me don't boy. Call me gay. Don't call me gay. Whatever, yeah. Mr. Grunty Pants. I am Mr. Gay Boy. Ah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Everyone calls me gay tonight. This, this dude tripping, bro. Right, this nigga straight tripping, bro. Well, uh, what was that touch tone? You called me were you, some shit, nigga. What you mean? Were you turning <laughs> off your recording equipment? What? Nothing. I didn't say anything. I'm gonna go. Just, just try you not to grunt go. anymore. Okay. Well, I'm going to be up there. I can't wait. I know you can't wait. Because you're probably going to get fired, uh, Mister. <laughs> yeah, you think so? I, I tell you what. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I, 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 I think so. I'm going to delete your I'm account. Pretty sure, I'm pretty sure so. If you're going to threaten yeah, you me, can't delete, you can't. You can't delete my account. Delete just delete my account, bro. <laughs> deleted. Oh, deleted. <laughs> you are deleted. It's deleted. You're not welcome uh, here I, anymore. I will, I, will, I will be up there. When, Tomorrow, when you come in here, you I, I will you, be up. I will be up there. You bring your I'll be up there. Bring your right. ID card. All right. I'm so just letting you know. I just let you know. I will be up here. I'll be up there. I got a witness. You on speakerphone. I got a witness. So you want to keep playing with me? Then you just got some problems. Bro. We we have witnesses that you morning, that you grunt. To talk to Frank. To talk to Frank, and you will lose your job, bro. All right. All right? Whatever. Bye. That's all I gotta say. Don't say don't say shit else to you. All right. Okay. Bye, homo. All right. I just said don't say nothing else. Bye, you homo. Still talking. Stop talking.
All right. Stop, stop talking. You win. And then if you call me homo, you you don't really have the problems. And I don't think you want them problems, bro. That's all I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I, I don't. Yeah, I'm I not know. afraid yeah, of you at all. I will all. be up there in the morning, though. So, uh, no, hey, you know what I'm saying? Finish out your last little hours, man, because this is your last day of work. Okay. Well, this, that, right? today was your last day at the right? gym because I just deleted your account. Uh, what? 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 I hung up. <sighs> I'm not going to check my email, Julian. You know how much email I have? I'm, I want to put my email box on the camera. So you can feel sad for me about this gigantic thing. I, like, like, I can't even find your shit. Buried in here under all this crap. Stop grunting, Jillian. Did I turn on the YouTube? Yeah, I did. Good. Okay, so now I'm going to make two phone calls. First, I'm going to call the first new gym from tonight. And I will be calling from the second new gym from tonight. And we'll see how that goes. Hey, um, this is Greg. I'm the district manager. Yes. Were you having problems there with phone calls or something? I, I, we had some. I'm sorry. We had some complaints that from the customers saying that that you guys were calling them and and making prank calls or something. Okay, well, uh, when I came in uh, today, my, because my shift is from 9 a.m., I'm, I'm sorry, 9 p.m. to 6 a.m., uh -huh. uh, the service rep that I relieved oh, stated that hot. a couple of people called here stating that. Yeah. Stating uh, what? I mean, what? What's happening? I'm sorry? What, what, what exactly is happening, though? I don't understand. Uh, she stated that... Uh, someone called and stated that, for instance, someone named Kevin oh, had called them. Kevin again. And we do not have a Kevin at this location. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm kind of... <laughs> I, I mean, that's all that she told me. That doesn't tell me anything. That doesn't make sense. Like, um, what, I'm sorry? Well, what happened? Like, what, what are, are customers calling you? What's your name? I'm sorry. My name's Roy. I'm a prank caller. I mean, I'm from. Right. The, I'm a district manager person, not a prank caller. Okay. That's a slip of the tongue. Okay. Um, well, she stated that one uh, person called and stated that her husband had come in for a uh, his seven day pass. Uh huh. And that she was charged on her credit card or something for some money. Come to find out, I'm I'm not sure. Oh, I I wasn't yeah. here. That one wasn't me. I'm sorry. That one wasn't me. I don't think I was responsible for that one. Yeah, I'm not sure what that one was about. Uh, okay, I mean I, you know, I mean it's, I came in and, and the woman just, the young lady just was stating this to me. So you mean Haley? Yes. Oh come on, just say her name. Don't don't pretend like she's a stranger. Oh no, I mean I. <laughs> Um, yeah, Haley, you know, was stating to me that this was, these were calls that were made oh, to her, and she weird. was kind of, like, confused about them also. Oh, yeah. Well, no, I work at the other location. We, we were just making funny phone calls because we were bored. Okay. Yeah, we are just messing with you guys. Sorry. Okay, I mean, so I'm kind of, I mean, I hate to say I'm kind of clueless as to what's going on. It's just, um, I mean, I work on every, I work on the weekends. Oh, I see. You know, so, yeah, yeah. So I don't know if any of this has happened Throughout the week or, or what? If a guy named Major comes in, hide. Just hide, okay? Just run. He sounds pretty... What's the name? Major. His name's Major. Major? Yeah, yeah. You don't want to mess with him. Okay. I mean, I'm here to do my job, girl. It's so it's oh, like... F fuck the job. Just run and hide. I'm sorry? Oh, and are you having problems with your computer there, by the way? Because it seems like we haven't received any of the check-ins from the past day. No, I mean, I mean, people are checking in. Do you know what time the last check-in was? 
You said when was the last check-in? Yeah, have you had any since you started your shift at 9? Okay, the last check-in was... Um, I mean, let me see. Okay. I mean, the last check-in was at 11.27. 11.27, yeah, that one's not here on the on the computer. That was last seven um, minutes ago. Yeah. Like, what's the phone number on that one? I'm sorry? The phone number? The phone number on... Yeah, what the customer's phone number? Because I could try and see if I can pull it up by the phone number. Okay, I mean, I can give you a member number. Oh, oh no, we pull it by the phone number here. The member number doesn't work. Because that just works at oh. your store only. It doesn't work through the whole oh. network. Okay. Can, can I hang up and call you right back? Because I've, I've got someone right in front of me. Oh, I can just hold. I can just hold. I'm sorry? I can just hold. I'll just okay. wait. Okay, hold on. hold on just a moment. Okay. I'm not really going to get a number. Actually, I'm going to hang up. I'm going to make another phone call to the other. Okay, I'm hanging up. I'm going to call the next one. I'm sure he would have given me numbers, but I don't want to do that on the air. That That's breaking the rules. Let's just be happy knowing that he probably would have. So what am I doing? I'm calling the second one from the first one's phone number. Thank you for calling to talk. Can I help you? Hi, this is Roy. I'm the district manager. With Hi, how are you doing? Oh, pretty good. Were you having problems with uh, phone calls or something? We had some complaints saying that there were weird phone calls coming in. Yes, or, um, I was getting those weird phone calls. Oh, what 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 was uh, happening on them exactly? Um, I didn't understand. Your name is Roy. Yeah, yeah, I didn't understand the messages that we'd received saying something about the that you guys were calling them or something. And may I ask who who called you and let you know? Oh, we I was it's on the complaint line that the customers are. Um, calling. but who called and let you know? Because usually they leave a complaint name. Oh, who called? Um, let's see. It would have been Ryan Drago? Nope. Sorry, sir. I don't know who, who Ryan Drago is. Well, that, that's who called me. Okay. Well, I'm going to call my manager. Is you? Do you have a uh, contact number that I can contact you back at? Yeah, but I'm not giving it to you. Okay. You, you thank be, you. you be like uh, a well, then, if you could call back tomorrow and uh, speak to our manager, they will be here from 9 to 3. Is this Berkeley? No, sir, it's not. Okay. Um, will you please call back tomorrow between 9 and 3? Okay. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> yeah, I guess there was a, yeah, I guess there was a shift change. Berkeley's not working anymore. She was much more suspicious than the first one. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have said I'm Roy. So now what? So because of YouTube, I can't really open this. Wait, no. I know something I can do. I'm going to trick the YouTubes. Dashy sent me a bunch of numbers. Yeah, someone's asking, don't you have a mute button so you can get numbers? And no, I don't have anything like that. I can mute, but if I mute, I can't hear it. I don't have a fancy system like uh, Sloth does and everyone else. Oh yeah, there was the um, the one guy that I tried to call earlier. The dash he sent me. Let me see if I can get a hold of that. It's almost ten o'clock though, so I th I think I have to quit. I'm not allowed to go over three hours. It's one of Carlito's new rules. 
Like, uh, you know, like, he, he's being really strict lately with all the new rules and everything, and I think I have to quit at exactly 10. <sighs> God, Carlito. So I am calling this guy from one of those numbers that I was on before. So maybe he'll answer this time. But probably not. Hello, you reach Robert at 757-414-1414. I'll try him some other day, but... Yeah, Dashy sent me a bunch of these numbers. I don't know how they get them. They're Twitter complainers, I guess. Like, this guy says that his auto payments won't work for Comcast. Here, let me click on his Twitter. I've set up auto payments five times now, and each month it doesn't work. Hey, is this John? Uh, yeah, this is John. Hey, this is Roy. I'm calling from Comcast. I understand you're having some problems getting your payments to work. Oh, uh, yeah, I, uh, I am. Um, I can't seem to uh, to get the automatic payment to, to oh, actually go through. That's weird. So you're trying to do it, like, did you go on the website and it just it wouldn't work? That's correct. All right, and and what was it doing? Was it just saying it's it's? What was it giving you any kind of message? No, it uh it it says it goes through, and it you know uh it like it says that I currently have a automatic payment. So here, let me. I'll I'll try and check and look on your account here and. Oh, here it's just popped up. It says, "John is a stupid asshole." There's the problem. You're stupid. Uh, that, that, that's it. Yeah. Okay. We figured it out then. Is there any, anything else I can do to help you? Oh uh, yeah. You can go fuck yourself. Oh hey hey. Why why'd you say that? That was rude. <laughs> yeah, it was. You, you shouldn't talk like that. This? You shouldn't talk like that to someone who has their has your account pulled up on their screen. Yeah. Who is this? Uh, this is Roy from Comcast. Okay, I'll do that right away, sir. And he's gone. Where'd you get all these, Dashy? This is crazy. This is a lot of these. Thanks, Comcast, for leaving me in my new apartment with no internet. If I can get AT&T to come out before Monday, I'm canceling my account. It's a threat. Ugh, these are all... Okay, hold on. have reached the voicemail box oh. of Eric Johnson. Eric. Oh yeah, that's the right person. Let me try again. Oh, 
Hello. Hey, Eric. Hi. Hello, this is Greg from AT&T Internet. I understand you're interested in setting up our services. Uh, no, actually, <laughs> so I'm, I'm not at the moment. Oh, okay, because I, I thought you were trying to get someone to come out before Monday. Like Comcast. Oh, oh. Comcast let us know that you're uh, trying to um, ditch them and get us to come out. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, they, they called okay. us up. They're like, uh They're like, uh, you can have this fucking guy. But I don't know. I, I heard what they told me. What you said about them, and it just made me think, like, you know, we don't really want a customer like you. Well, that's that's. Sounds yeah, yeah. So I don't know. I think you might just be stuck with Comcast if they'll ever show up and fix your stuff. Yeah, you are probably right. <laughs> yep. Yep. I don't think we want you though. I don't think we want your business. Okay. Because you'll you'll just you know, you'll just get online and slander us a bunch. Yeah. What do we need that for? Right. You'll you'll just right. like you know three or four years down the road you'll start slandering us and say oh I'm switching to Comcast, fuck these AT and T people. <laughs> that's that's possible. It's very possible. Yeah. Yep. That's true. So okay, I hope Comcast comes. All right. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. You too. Bye. That was boring. That was so boring. It's my fault it was boring. I take full responsibility for that. Sorry, YouTube people. I, I almost forgot to unmute for you guys. I'm still getting used to this thing. I, I had to mute because I turned on music. Now I'm unmuting. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to call Tucker Mike. Sorry. Here it goes. I should just leave it alone. It was hilarious the first time. <laughs> the first three times. Hello. No one is available to take your call. Please leave. Okay, one more try. Hey, yeah, what the hell? Carlito hasn't come on and made any fart noises. It's not a real show if Carlito doesn't fart in my show. Hello? Tucker Mike? Tucker Mike? Tucker Mike. Hello? Tucker Mike. Tucker Mike. Hmm. I'm about to kick Jillian from the chat room. Real sick of Jillian shit. Okay, so I guess the show's over then. Let's see. Uh, Kansas. Yeah, I think I might be all done. I'm, I'm like looking through numbers. I've called them all and they haven't answered. Maybe I should give Randy Dandy one more call. I will call him from here. Let, let me let me um, let me change my number so it's in his local area. All right, calling Randy Dandy, who's not going to answer. Oops, wrong thing. Do the rest of the show in Echo. Okay.
Ecor says I'm supposed to do the rest of the show in Echo. Hey there, is Randy home? Hello? Hello? Catherine? I'm under your house. Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Smoke weed every day. All right, I'll call for Randy later then. Bye. All right, no luck with that. I don't think doing an entire show in Echo is a good idea. Hey, Acid Pez. Hi, RBCP. What you doing? Jerking off. What are you doing? Oh, oh, you know, the same. And doing a show. Really? Yep. Can I grunt with you? Can you what? Ejaculate and do things. Let's have a masturbation contest. Yes. <laughs> get Matt, let's get laugh track Matt in here and have a makeout party. Okay. <laughs> that was his thing, I guess. <clears throat> Hello? Are you there? Acid Pez? Hello? Hello? What the hell? <laughs> Alright, Acid Pez is having audio problems as usual. So yeah, I think it's time to go. I'm Seriously, I'm done. I'm done for the night. It was fun. We, we had one single person that was pretty funny, and that was Tucker Mike. Some of you might remember Tucker Mike from, you know, from Carlito's show. He used to call in a lot and used to be on around a lot in the good old days. But yeah, yeah, we had fun, didn't we, I think? Did a full uh, three hours. and stuff, and yeah. Maybe someone will take over for me now. I think it's time for a science show from Sloth. So if uh, no show happens after I quit for the night, then you can blame Sloth. It's all his fault. Yeah, Jill, that was really Tucker Mike. Didn't you recognize his voice? That was definitely him. Who else could it be? I said Tucker Mike, and he responded, so it must be him. Anyway, yeah, uh, Prank Call Nation. Here, i got to play a Prank Call Nation thing. I, uh, this is one of the things that happened because of Patreon. Uh, I, I made drops. The largest, 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 largest prank call radio station in the nation. You're listening to Prank Call Nation. Prank Call Nation. Prank Call Nation. So, you know, if you ever forget what you're listening to or what station you're listening to, we'll be playing those occasionally to, uh, to remind you. So you're welcome for that. Everyone's saying the ouch, ouch, my ears, my ears, the pain, the pain. All right, thanks for listening, everyone. Prank Call Nation, phonelosers.org. Goodbye. <laughs>